Hello friends, it's Carla here today for Scrap Shots and I'm showing you the simple stories, simple pages, and it's a scrapbook kit. And this one is called Dreamer. Uh, this is a new kit that they've come out with and uh, they have all the elements to make four scrapbook pages and you don't uh, even need scissors. You just can punch everything out. The backgrounds are ready for you. You have complete instructions on layering and it's a really good way to either start scrapbooking or if you're a seasoned scrapbooker, it's a great way to make two double page layouts and get them in your albums quickly. You've got room for lots of photos. Uh, so these would be beautiful gifts for anyone or if you have some lovely pictures that would coordinate with these, they're beautiful for spring and summer as well. Um, you can get your photos on those and get those into your albums. I actually used a little bit of foam tape and added some dimension. Here's a look at those first two pages. The images are so beautiful and this really gives you a great idea about layering that you could use in your other pages as well. Even though the backgrounds are pre-printed, uh, you could definitely use your own papers to recreate these and here's a look at the right side of the second double page layout. I further embellished some of the flowers and the butterflies by adding some Nouveau Tonic Dream Drops, Glitter Drops, and Crystal Glaze to different areas of the embellishments. And I just wanted to show you how nice and quick these beautiful pages go together. So I layered on the striped border according to the instructions. I used some uh, Nouveau liquid adhesive to glue those down. And a couple of the areas like the borders there, I actually added a little bit of ink um, using my Distress Oxides. And the instructions are very clear. You get photos to reference as well. And you just layer everything out. I found it helpful to find the pieces that I was to layer and kind of get an idea about where to put them and then decide what I would use foam tape on and uh, how to place those. So you don't have to use foam tape, but I found it kind of gave it a little bit of dimension and some neat effects. Here are the glitter drops. This one is White Blizzard. It's actually one of my favorites and it has a little bit of an iridescent look to it when it's dry and depending on what color you put it over, it has a little bit of a different color. So just by adding some of these drops, it really gave a glittery effect like a gemstone effect to the layout. I think a little bit of glitter on cards and scrapbook pages is just so pretty. These dream drops are beautiful. There are seven or eight colors now, I think, and I've used the gold and the lemon on some of the stems there on the flowers. They are so beautiful depending on the color there, because they are iridescent, the dream drops, uh, you get a little bit of a different color. And sometimes when you put them on a dark background, it will actually look different than a light background. So I'm just doing some little drops and dots and you can get a pretty fine drop just because of the way the nozzle is. And these are self leveling so they really smooth out nicely. So these drops and the crystal glaze and the glitter, there's lots of them in the Scrap Shot store. So you'll be able to have a look at those. I will link that store in the comments below and you can find this beautiful page kit there as well. Be sure also to check the previous video where I showed the 
uh, card kit, the new card kit from Simple Stories. So here's a look at that page. You can see how nice and quick those go together and they are just beautiful. So I can't wait to get these in my album and put some lovely photos in them. And uh, you can have a look there at how much dimension and shine those dream drops gave to the page as well. Be sure to check the description below where you'll be able to find the Dreamer page kit in the Scrapshot store, as well as lots of other Simple Stories kits and beautiful tonic nouveau drops and glitter. And uh, there's lots of other fun scrapbooking products as well there. So thank you so much for stopping by. I'd love for you to like and subscribe and have a really awesome week. Bye-bye.